Hello people of the swinging world, my name is Olenka, I am Lindy Hopper from Kyiv and I am finally home. Cannot believe it's been a month already. You may ask, why did I return to the country at war? Well, here is my friend and co-host on this channel, Alina, with the best possible explanation. Kyiv is just the perfect place to live uh, before war and even now. I, I'm so excited that I even lose my voice, so yeah, Kyiv is just the... the best place in the world. I plan to do a small vlog about our life here, but it is just not much to tell. Let's call it normal with a chance of explosions. We do not have much chances to forget about war. We see it every day and everywhere. For example, here is the Kyiv city app. Red circles is the beginning of air alarm, green ones the end of it. This is a lottery we are forced to play. And here you'd expect I ask you to donate or explain that Russia attacked Ukraine and why it is not okay on so many levels. But no, not in this video. Here is what I was thinking. You can help in a way that is very natural for the swing dance community. You see, a lot of Ukrainian dancers are involved in this fight in many different ways. And we do not have much income as teachers or artists today. Not many people dance in Ukraine, <laughs> you know. But in Europe you dance, right? As the pandemic is not really an issue anymore, I see a lot of festivals being planned. So why don't you hire a Ukrainian teacher, performer or DJ for your event? It's a win-win. You'll get an awesome artist for your lineup and we'll get some money to support the victory of Ukraine. And to live, basically. Also, most of us can really use a timeout from the curfews. There is, however, a chance you do not know any Ukrainian teacher. And that is why I'm making this video. Unfortunately, most likely you cannot invite the couple. Because men are not allowed to leave the country without special permission and we don't know for how long. But fortunately, Ukraine has some very strong followers. I mean, a lot of them. And because there are so many, I decided to break this video into two parts. So I splitted the followers randomly. Feel free to subscribe not to miss the next video. Let's start with the girl who you probably already know. Pretty much every competition she's in, she smashed. This is Ira Ishuk at Snowball 2017. She took the second place with Seth. Another placement Orient Lindy Express 2018, Invitational Jack and Jill with Bogdan. And the first place in Classic Routine in Vilnius 2019 with Andrew C. And then was the pandemic. Ira now has a day job, but she was teaching in her rank with Andrew a few weeks ago, so maybe she can find the time for your festival too. Hire her if you need a teacher who's dancing all night and chatting with everybody. Olya is the person who brought horse line to Kyiv, so she can bring it to your place too. She is one of the creators of Jazz Age Show, I mentioned in the previous video. She creates performances in solo jazz and solo blues, mambo and even tap. Hire her if you need a Polish dancer with raw energy and impeccable rhythm and style. And here is her sister, Ksenia. She's also dancing in the Jazz Age show, but in Kyiv she's famous as a shag dancer. Together with Taras, they won an online edition of Swing Paradise Trinity Contest, where you dance collegiate shag, St. Louis shag and Balboa. And here is a fun video. With her boyfriend Alex, they recreated the most famous shag routine. You can probably recognize it. Hi Xenia if you need someone with very fast fit and unusual perspective on usual things. Yeah. Yeah. You've definitely seen her. Sofia is everywhere now. She started dancing in Kyiv when she was 15 and became obsessed with jazz. Now when she moved to Europe she's dancing even more, like every weekend on another festival. Although she doesn't live in Ukraine today, she's still Ukrainian, so hire her if you want someone young and ambitious. This girl is probably the most brilliant choreographer I know. 
Elena is making amazing solo showcases with a lot of movement around the floor and fun musical ideas. Here is her team performing at the chase. By the way, she also has a YouTube channel. Check it out in the right corner. For example, there is a cool project about dance moves with explanations. Hire Elena for a fresh view on choreography and solo classes your students would enjoy. But it's not only about the dance. Zhenya performs at a Jazz Age show both as a dancer and as a singer, sometimes in the same song. She's also a part of Good Company Band, who are frequent guests at our dance parties. Well, we were when we had those. And hopefully will be again. Zhenya has evacuated to Italy, so you should catch her before she came back. Her swinging voice will be a great addition to any band. And well, here is me. I don't have much titles internationally. This Open Strictly at Balkan Lindy Hop Championship is probably the only placement I've got abroad, and I have very little experience teaching without my partner Max. But I'm a DJ. Before the pandemic, I played as a staff DJ at Dragon Swing Lindy Shock and Sofia Swindon's Festival, and as a guest at many more. Hire me if you need a good DJ, but also a person who gets crazy on the dance floor, in a good way. So, this is it, for now. I will leave the links to girls' profile in the description, but if you already know them as friends, feel free to write them and ask how are they doing, even if you are not an event organizer. And uh, see you in the next video!